Hey guys, Billy, Archangel Art Studio. Yes, I'm still alive. I'm still here. I just haven't put out videos as frequently as I'd like to. Sometimes life takes precedent over art or anything else. But I did miss being down in the studio, and I am going to be trying to get down here more often. So I'm just doing a, a little pour for you guys today. Um... Today we're using Lorez Angel Wings White. And I got, I'm about out of that, I gotta get some more. Uh, for my base, I'm using the Color Cottage Midnight Black. I'm using the Color Cottage Silver Mist. I'm using Green Meadow from the Color Cottage. And I'm also using Totally Teal, which is also Color Cottage. And if you guys haven't ever used Color Cottage or you're looking for some good micas, they will be in our description box. You can click on the link and go right to their website and go shopping. They... Um, they have a ton of awesome colors. They got a color called uh, Copper Penny that is, it's crazy, crazy cool. And of course I'm using Pro Glass 1000. And you guys know, if you're looking for a good resin, I highly recommend Pro Glass. You can click on our, click on their link in our description, take you right to them. And, Again, Pro Glass is offering 10% off and free shipping in the lower 48 if you use the word Archangel in their checkout box in the code. And their price, man, their price is already better than any of the other resins out there. And it's such a quality resin and they're adding 10% off and free shipping and handling. So it's like, man, it just, I don't know, it just don't make sense not to get it to even just to try it out. All right. Enough chit chat. Let's get to pouring. And this this black is, and you can see I'm using one of our Archangel Art boards. This is just a 12 inch round, and I put a violet uh, acrylic across it, and just brushed it out just to cover the board. Which again, you know, it's MDF. We don't have to prime it. I just I guess got in the habit of priming my board, so I just always do it. This black is so pretty. Yeah. All right, let's get this out of the cup. And I don't have any direction. I know one of the things I always say is before you have a pour, I told beginners, you know, have a direction because your resin has a pot life, it has a drying time, so have a plan, have a a direction that you're going to go in so you don't, you know, waste time, um, which I don't have a direction. <laughs> I just came down to waste some time. No, I, uh... I love how that metallic black, when you just, I, I honestly, I want to do a piece and just do that and leave it because I think that is so neat. I really should. That'll be my next piece. Just black. All right. Grab my torch, pop some bubbles. That right there in itself, I think, is really cool. <clears throat> but I already got this other stuff mixed up, so I don't know what I want to do with it. <clears throat> this silver from the Color Cottage, it looks like spray paint, metallic spray paint. It looks so cool. I don't know what I want to do. I think I'm just going to... Do 
do some abstract lines being how it's an abstract right we'll see what we end up with may be cool may not but you guys know how I roll I don't really care we're gonna make it cool and if it's not well guess what all I did was prime a board for to use next time <laughs> That's how I feel about it. And I don't know what this is going to turn out like. I just really like the little thin wispy lines and how when they spread out and touch sometimes they they really give you a cool effect. Like, I think that's pretty neat. You know, lots of people probably be like, that is hideous. <clears throat> I had a comment on a <laughs> um, the one piece I did that I was calling the Archangel Splash or the Angel Splash. I don't remember exactly what we called it. I thought it was pretty neat, you know. It's nothing special, I understand. But <laughs> somebody commented. And they said, that's not art. That is... Like, garbage, a three-year-old could do that. It's like, okay, I get it. You know, not for everybody. I'm not, I don't claim to be the world's greatest innovator or artist. It was just something that I thought of and thought I'd put it out there and I'm not bashing that person that made the comment. You know, everybody's entitled to their own opinion. So, one man's trash is another man's treasure. I kind of like that. And I have some clear that I'm going to put down in it too. I'm going to see what we, what we can come up with. Maybe we'll just run the clear in different directions. Get some crazy lines going. Yeah, that is neat. Wow. That's pretty cool. Now I got some white. I don't know if I should run the white the same direction or let's go a different direction just to mix it up. We'll go the same way we went with the clear. Wow. Might not have should have put the white in there, huh? Tell you what, we got more colors. We'll we'll make it work out in the end. How's that? I'll go back across the same way I did in the beginning with the other colors, and we'll cover up some of this white, and we'll just keep doing it until we get something that we like, or that I like, or that you like, or that somebody likes. It's madness, I know. Complete chaos. Now I don't know what that Angel Wings White is gonna do in here. I know it's gonna, when I put the heat gun to it or the torch, it's gonna do some selling or some lacing. And I don't think I want to use my heat gun because I don't think I want to blow this all over the place. I really kind of like those little wispy lines and kind of like it to stay there. Well, it's different, that's for sure. And I like different. may not be your traditional if there is such a thing as a traditional resin pour I don't know that there is this just kinda looks I don't know it looks layered like I 
I like that. I like what the, I don't know if you can really see what the clear does. It gives it this depth and dimension, this 3D look. That's really neat. I like that a lot. I really like this piece. Had no idea what it was gonna do like this. Again, that was just an idea that my scattered brain. I sit around sometimes when I'm actually not sit around, but when I'm working sometimes, I'm thinking about resin art and I'm thinking, what can I do that that's different? Something that well, that's different. I really like it. I honestly really do like this. <clears throat> Let me get these edges. I love that kind of lattice wicker almost look. I don't know if I should do any more white. Maybe, maybe a, a couple little. Okay, I'll do some more. And we appreciate you guys sponsoring our channel you know uh not sponsoring it uh subscribing which i guess that's a, a way of sponsorship you know you we appreciate you guys watching our videos and commenting you know that uh really gives me a drive to keep doing it even with the negative comments i like the negative comments just as much as i like the positive comments Maybe I'd try a little. I guess maybe not. I won't try a little black. I don't have no more black. I can't. There we go. This is cool. The stuff you, the stuff you can come up with if you just go outside the box or comfort zone and just say, "Man, I want to do something different, something, something cool." And somebody's probably already done this before. I don't know. It's like the what I call the Archangel Splash. You know, somebody's probably done it. I haven't, I hadn't seen it. And if somebody has done it, I wasn't trying to copy anybody. I honestly haven't. I hadn't seen that anywhere that anybody had done, so I was, uh, in my head, I was being an innovator because I hadn't seen nobody do it. So I was believing that I was uh, starting something, maybe, maybe not. You never know. This is, I keep saying it, this is neat, I like it. I like how these give like these 3D veins, the clear goes and gives it a completely different depth. 
a different look and a different feel. That's pretty neat. I think I'm going to stop messing with it and well, that's that. Ladies and gentlemen, it is done. Wow, that is pretty neat. It's just kind of chaotic. All right, I'm gonna turn these overhead lights off and I'll give you guys a close-up view of it. There it is in all its glory. I don't know what you want to call it, but uh, camera don't want to focus on it, does it? Alright. It's got some really neat spots in it. Overall, pretty neat. I like it. Let me know what you guys think, man. Leave me some comments. You know? Yay, nay, good, bad. Stupid, beautiful. I think it's awesome. Come on, focus. All right, guys. Well, I appreciate you, each and every one of you, the ones that watch my video, the ones that subscribe to my channel. You know, if you're not a subscriber, uh, go ahead and subscribe now. Hit that bell next to the subscribe button. That way when I come out with a new video, you get alerted. And you guys keep doing what you do. I'll keep doing what I do. And as always, see ya!